Hello everyone, we're back and we're here with more Samba Night. Holy Night, I had no idea that this was a two-parter fight, but it is a two-parter fight. Oh, but it's not really a two-parter fight. What is going on here? Go here. That's... Okay. I think I should be fine if I do this here. Let's just get into it. Remember, if you like this video, leave a like. As we last left off, this intense fight was going on. <laughs> Aww. I think the American team might be meant to finish this. But when the Quetzal sisters dodged out of the way, Bunyan growing bigger by a minute ended up running into Lion Man. And now the ropes are both electrocuting both of them. And now the ropes are electrocuting both of them? That tingles. Oh, but my shoulders are all stiff from cutting down trees, and I think they feel better now. This, this can't be right. My shoot, my suit, my shoot, my suit should be completely insulated from external direct current shocks. The only way this could happen is if someone switched out my direct current for an infernal alternate current. Oh, now you've done it. I'm not quite sure how changing the current would affect the suit insulating properties, but anyway, now's a chance. You underestimated us, yes? The true luchadora doesn't need ropes to pull off an aerial attack, no? Braderman, crouch down and put your hands together, please. I get it, you want me to rope and post for you, okay? I'm ready. Whee! Do you see wind knocked out of him? Impossible. It's actually legitimately over. So who the hell am I going to be fighting? Good job and another win. Yes, I'm glad too. It helps that our opponent did some of the work digging their own grave though. Something wrong, Quetzal Mask? No, it's nothing. I just feel like I'd realize something very important for a moment. Please don't mind me. I just got caught up in my own thoughts. Yeah? Anyway, these matches sure are getting tougher each round. Though I guess that makes sense, since they've all had to be strong enough to make it this far. We were lucky this time, but we need to stay on our guard and keep training hard for the matches to come. I'm glad you're so diligent. It's nothing special. Any knight would do their best to secure victory. And I still have a long way to go, so I have to try extra hard to make up for all my shortcomings. Please don't be so hard on yourself, Bradamante. I've already learned a lot from just from you by being a shielder. I think it's wonderful how you're so dedicated to improving. I'm just flailing around, trying my best, and to get caught up where I should be. For example, back when I got captured by monsters because I wasn't paying enough attention, a true knight would have gladly chosen death over the humiliation of being taken prison, prisoner. But I couldn't do that. Even when I told them to kill me, I kept trying to think of a way to turn the tables. It doesn't sound like you were doing anything wrong to me. You think so? Full? Hmm? Wait, do you hear something? Not that you mention it, yes. That's a sound like a child. They must be lost. Let's go check on them. Ah, ah. I know how you feel, but please try to stay calm. It's unfortunate that we lost, but we fought as fairly as we could. You should be proud of that. I think I'm going to try Sanson's voice from when I did Agartha all those, all those times ago. Oh, the more so given that our opponent resorted to base turkery and borderline cheating. I know. I know, but this stinks. You don't really know how to feel, Sanson. You're too grown up. Oh, I didn't think that uh, that's it. I'm just trying to... Oh, god damn it. I'm just good at finding the middle ground. Though I wonder if Marie might be disappointed. Whoa, you guys must be the French team. <laughs> this voice literally hurts me. Oh, hello, Master. I didn't know you were competing, though. I can understand Santa Lily's reasons, but I'm a little surprised that you're here, too, Samson. I am indeed here. Though, of course, it is our little Santa here who is a team's heart and soul. This is the weirdest, the worst French accent in the world. Thanks for the invitation. So you need a reindeer, huh? That sounds so, that's base. this is basically just quite the French and the Mexicans. Um, 
Thank you for the invitations. You need a reindeer, huh? That sounds so fun. Would a glass horse work? Uh, she was coming dangerously close to competing in the tournament, so I felt it was incumbent on me to volunteer in her stead. Reindeer Master! I didn't know you were competing as well. Well, of course I am. I'm Santa, after all. I can't let some Im imposter try to take over being Santa themselves. An official Christmas has to have an official Santa. I'm sure my mentor would say the same thing. But I really... But I really did inherit this title from out there, you know? I'm in this official as they come, really. That's what I heard, but I don't, I don't know. You're showing a lot of skin. And there's that whole Samba thing, too. Stare. At any rate, you seem pretty upset earlier. Is everything okay? Yeah, well, part of it is just the, unus the usual frustration that comes from losing a match, but... I would have been fine if we'd lost fair and square. But they cheated. They totally cheated. Cheated? Well, no wonder you're upset. That goes against everything we knights stand for. Thank you, lady with the vaguely French color scheme. How'd they cheat exactly? Well... Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think you guys are doing? It's a good thing I just happened to pass by to sense danger when I did. Getting first-hand info about a team still in the running for a team that beat is prohibited. No way this cat's letting that happen on my furry watch. Now go on, get out of here. Hmm, I didn't see you do carrying that much when the rules during our match. Just goes to show that the rules here can change at the organizer's whim. Just goes to show that the rules here can change on the organizer's whim. <coughs> Fuck this was it. It's unfortunate, but since we didn't sign a contract to compete, there's nothing we can do about it. The best thing we can do is accept loss with some grace. By the way, when will we know the tournament's results? We'll be broadcasting the final match on every monitor here, ma'am. But that point, we won't need to bother keeping info from every for about every team's secrets. I see. Then it'll be worth staying around to cheer for the other teams. All right then, we better get to take our leave. We'll be praying for your victory. Pow. Say, have you ever seen this? If you take a smooth flat stone and throw it in a body of water like so. Wow, was that some kind of spell? Huh? Anyone can do that? Teach me, teach me, please. Hehe, <laughs> you're better with children than I thought, yes? Very well, I hear you loud and clear. I promise you will do our best to win this tournament for your sake as well as ours, yes. Now who the fuck am I fighting? I still wonder who the other team was though. The cheating must have been egregious for Lily to be that upset. Well, it's unnatural to focus on the negatives when you're thinking about back on a loss, yes? So if you want to have a good clean lucha and respect your opponents 100% even if you lose, your only option is to keep practicing diligent? Full. Can we help you with something? You the Quetzal sisters? We sure are. Did you come here to dance the samba with us? Nothing personal. We're just following orders. Don't worry, we won't kill you. We'll settle for an arm and a leg. Orders? You mean someone told you to do this? You should be ashamed of yourselves. Well, at least this should... <laughs> well, at least this should make for a nice post-match cooldown. Yes, let's get them. Let's, let's fuck them up. Destroy them. Oh god. My throat hurts, man. Oops. Ah, uh, wait, no. Okay. That should hopefully be enough. Yeah, buddy. The power of Stella, man. It's too strong. It's too black. Too strong. Not since King of Fighters, 98. 
I actually don't think it's going to be enough, so I'm going to have to use another one. Booty clear. She stunned him. Too. She stunned her too. That's fine. I mean, I really shouldn't do another butt shot, but... Actually, I'm going to need it. That's not strong enough. Ah, oh, damn it, I should have used the defense down. I would have been able to completely wipe them out in turn one. Alright, so let's do this, and if that's not enough, then... But, but stuff. That's gonna be enough. Hey! Oh yeah, baby. Level 5. You'll love to see it. I don't have any bronze material. And that's what happened, yes? Four. Given the highly suspect timing, I'm guessing the team you're up against next must have sent them. That would mean you're probably going up against the cheaters Lily Santa Lily was so angry about. Good grief. <gasps> so that's how Bradamante got injured. Ow, ow, ow. I'm sorry I was so careless. Normally I could handle opponents like that no problem, but I was still a little tired from having just fought a match. But that's okay, I think I'll be fine before it's time for the next match. And even if I'm not, it would be unbecoming of a knight to complain. The. The. That does it. Now I'm pissed. How dare they do this to my student, my friend. A little mischief is one thing, but I will not tolerate this sort of cowardice. Oops, silly me. I apologize for my unladylike unlady -like behavior. <laughs> I'm a saint this time, a pure-hearted holy maiden. I won't be cracking my knuckles or sending dolphins flying. Nope. But even so, there are some things I cannot simply allow to happen. Right. Alright, I've made up my mind. If your next opponents are this unscrupulous, then you're starting at a disadvantage as well. Something even worse could end up happening in the ring tomorrow. Something my fighting styles can't stop. Eep. Don't worry, coach. I'll be fine. If you here teaching me, I'm sure I can handle anything. Effort alone will solve this, and so I'm going to teach you something I never intended to. I'm not sure if you'll be able to use them, but I have to teach you all the same. It's time for you to learn the 52 fighting styles I sealed away from being too dangerous. 52? You mean you still have 52 more techniques I don't know about, Lady Martha? My full fighting style has many different techniques. Unfortunately, some of them have issues. At any rate, we only have a single day for you to learn these styles before your next match. I don't know how much uh, they'll help you co counter their dirty tricks, plus the training will be hard and grueling. I won't force you, but, I, but knowing these styles may help you in a fight ahead, so what do you say? I'll do it. That's the spirit. I couldn't ask for more of a... For a I couldn't ask for more from a partner that is a determination to keep moving forward, yes? Say, Martha, I don't suppose you could teach me too while you're at it, could you? No, I couldn't. There wouldn't be any point since my styles would not mesh well with yours. Besides, I think you already have everything you need. After all, it's not just as though you fa you face your faces only know how to fight clean, right? Hmm, yes, I suppose you have a point. I think I know about these... I think I know what these forbidden techniques are now. Mm-hmm. All right then, let's begin. Go ahead and get in the ring, and whatever you do, don't let your guard down. My forbidden 52 street fighting moves are all un un ultra practical techniques meant to be used in live combat. Come at me with everything less than your best, um, and you will end up on the mat. Boy, pop, yo, yo, yo. Okay. And that's it for today. So join me tomorrow as we read more of the story. I swear we'll finish this. Wow, I didn't even realize that the quest only has eight days left. Till next time, everyone. Goodbye. <laughs>